Welcome to today's topic about Apple moving out of China. In recent years, Apple has been a major player in China's tech industry, but with the company's recent decision to shift its production out of China, there are many questions about the potential impact on both Apple and China. In this video, we'll explore what this move could mean for Apple, Chinese phone makers, and China's tech industry as a whole. So, let's dive in. Reasons for leaving The first reason for this decision is the ongoing trade war between the US and China, which has resulted in increased tariffs on Chinese imports. These tariffs have led to a rise in production costs for Apple, making it less profitable for the company to manufacture in China. Secondly, there have been concerns about the working conditions in some of the factories that Apple uses in China. The company has faced criticism for not doing enough to ensure that its suppliers are providing safe and ethical working conditions for their employees. Thirdly, there have been rising tensions between the US and China over issues such as intellectual property theft, which has led Apple to consider moving production out of China to protect its own intellectual property. The COVID-19 pandemic and other factors have disrupted global supply chains, causing delays and shortages in the production of Apple products. This has highlighted the need for the company to diversify its supply chain by moving some of its production facilities out of China to reduce its dependence on the country. Geopolitical tensions The ongoing geopolitical tensions between the US and China have created a lot of uncertainty for companies doing business in China. This has led to increased scrutiny of companies like Apple and raised concerns about potential risks to their operations in the country. Moving production to other countries could help mitigate these risks. The cost of labor in China has been increasing steadily in recent years. This, coupled with the trade war, has made it less attractive for Apple to continue manufacturing in China. Moving to other countries with lower labor costs could help the company maintain its profit margins. Additionally, the move away from labor-intensive manufacturing could also help China address some of the social and environmental issues that have been associated with the industry in the country. By moving towards higher-skilled and higher-paying jobs, China could potentially improve working conditions and reduce pollution levels in the long run. Finally, the departure of Apple could also open up opportunities for Chinese entrepreneurs and startups to fill the gap in the market. With the right support and investment, these companies could become the next big players in the tech industry, driving economic growth and job creation in the country. Apple moving production out of China, Chinese phone makers could potentially gain access to highly skilled workers and modern infrastructure that Apple is leaving behind. This could lead to increased efficiency and competitiveness in the Chinese phone market. The shift away from China could result in cost savings for Apple's competitors who are already based in China. As Apple moves production to other countries with higher labor costs, Chinese phone makers may have a cost advantage by remaining in China. Apple's departure, Chinese phone makers may have more access to key components and materials that were previously dominated by Apple. This could allow Chinese phone makers to produce phones with similar quality and specifications as Apple, without being dependent on Apple's supply chain. Apple's move could create a void in the Chinese market that Chinese phone makers could fill. With Apple potentially losing market share in China due to its move, Chinese phone makers could have an opportunity to gain market share and increase their brand recognition. The shift away from China by Apple presents a potential opportunity for Chinese phone makers to gain a competitive advantage in the global phone market. Addressing labor issues, as I mentioned earlier, labor issues have been a major concern in the Chinese manufacturing industry. By moving away from labor-intensive manufacturing and towards more high-tech industries, the Chinese government could address some of these issues. For example, Chinese workers could be trained to work in the tech industry, which would require different skill sets and could lead to better working conditions and higher wages. In conclusion, Apple's decision to move out of China could present new opportunities for the country. While there may be some short-term challenges, such as job losses and economic impacts, there are many potential long-term benefits for China. That's it for today's video. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this. See you in the next one.